Hi guys. If you click that thumbnail, you know where you reached. This is Regions by Marvelous Madame. I am, oh, Marvelous One. Marvel in the flesh, welcome back to the show. Thank you guys for your patience. Let's go ahead and get right into the proceedings. Okay, if you're new here with me, hello, hello. If you are returning, welcome back. And if you are subscribed to my tribe, ow, this is going to be your February 2019 mid-month love reading for the beautiful fire sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Ow. What's good, fam bams? Okay, guys, I have um, asked and, and you have, wait a minute, I asked you voted, and now I'm delivering. This video, just like all of the rest of them, will be extended, okay? I have, at this point, pinned a workaround for each and every one on at the bottom of each and every one of the videos. How does Bay feel about you for um, February when we started the extensions? Um, and I want to just let you guys know if you're having any issues, you already know everything is there. I also... Um, to put that same message in the community tab. So if you're having an, um, a, an issue, just let me know. I don't know what is going on, but we don't have to get caught up in the who, what, when, where, and why. All I want to do is fix it, okay? So um, tapping into your energy, Sagittarius, I just want to let you, go, you know that no matter where... I was mentally as far as looking at the 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 cards like for example I'm shuffling and I am looking down at the cards I'm like hmm but these are not cards that are falling out these are just cards that catch my eye I always end and I'm and I'm going in that direction and then I'm like hmm so I shuffle some more and I'm you know clearing my head and meditating trying to tap in and I keep coming back to this ten of cups then we have in your partner's energy we have two fives someone feels betrayed i don't know whether this is going to come back out you also um in the whispers of love oracle it was um have faith that stood out to me and also it was no need to worry for the angel answer oracle let's go ahead and get right into these cards um Yes, this is going to be a love reading. We are going to be examining the energy that surrounds you. Um, once we get that squared away and taken care of, we're going to be going ahead and extending it. It's going to be the complete spread, the exact same thing, a little bit different than how does Bay feel about you. The exact same spread, but for your partner. And then we do sort of a comparison. Sometimes they're on a completely different path. And we're piecing things together. And it really just depends. Um, sometimes it is an extension of what we've already said. Sometimes you guys are mirroring each other. And I'm using four different decks. So we never know where the cards are going to fall. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right, universe, spirit, angels, and my guides, go ahead and provide me with the love energy that surrounds my Sagittarians right now. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Give me what the answer is for the angels that surrounds the energy that I am picking up on for the Sagittarius. Okay, guys, let's find out. And success. All right, Sag, so whatever this is, is going to be successful. If there is anything that you are dealing with right now with love, it's going to be success. You're being guided. At the bottom of that deck was not to worry earlier. So that looks like it coincides with what's going on. Um, and let's see what you have to be successful about. You can apply this wherever you'd like. This is a general love reading. It's not going to resonate with everybody. But I know I don't have to tell my enlightened watchers that you guys already know. But sometimes we have to do that. Show me spirit. What does the Sagittarians have to be successful about? See... There we go. That one kept coming out, and I'm not I'm not fond of that. Oh. That 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 felt better. The union of two hearts. Okay, Sage. The love connection. A love connection that defies an explanation. Is that the reason why I kept seeing the ton of cups? I don't know. I kept seeing a ton of cups. 
in a clarifying deck, I kept seeing the Page of Cups. Um, so you're being guided for those that this resonate with. A connection. A connection. Mm. Look at that. A connection. Someone that you're connecting with. Hmm. I, I, I pick up on a difference of energies, though. I really don't feel like the partner or the person that you're connecting with thinks that this is going to be successful. I don't know whether that makes sense. Oh, God, they're popping out everywhere. The first one was the five, and this one was the princess of wands. Show me, spirit, the energy that surrounds Sagittarius. Let's find out how you're feeling about this. Oh, my goodness. Eight of Cups. Hmm. Let's find out what this Eight of Cups is about. Are you going to be leaving a person? Are you going to be walking away from things that no longer serve you in an F? Oh, no, I think it's over. Yeah, I'm really feeling like somebody is not is in, yeah. You're being guided that there's a union of two hearts. Are you leaving a current relationship and walking into another one? Ooh, four swords. Hmm. Okay. Show me, spirit. Ooh, stress, baby, stress. What is going on, my honeys? What is it? Something's definitely coming to a close. Something is definitely coming to an end. But I, I feel love somewhere. It's that five of pentacles, two of pentacles. Two of pentacles, there's some juggling. Okay. Bottom of the deck. Judgment. The awakening is here. Ha! Ah, the lovers, baby. Buck naked Susie, Sagittarius. Do you see her? Do you see her? This is a choice. And the five of pentacles. I saw it. Okay. Now, I, this energy has come out of left field. I don't recall you guys having a choice to make, Sag, but apparently you do. These cards scream that this union of two hearts is going to be successful. You're definitely leaving something or somebody with this Eight of Cups. It's de a definite um, end of a relationship with the Tower. The Four of Swords is showing that right now you are blocking out any and all, any and all um, emotion mentally toward a situation that you've already made your mind up about. You're mentally resting. You're deciding that it's too stressful with this Ten of Wands. You can't go anywhere but to the Ace after that. And as a result of that, there's some juggling or some decisions that has to be made right here. I honestly don't feel like a decision has to be made. I feel like the decision is made. The bottom of the deck energy shows me that you're being guided to answer the call with the judgment card. Also... You're feeling a little left out in the cold with the Five of Pentacles. Possibly have to spend some money to leave this union. And here is Buck Naked Susie all over again. Just like what the Pisces had. So this represents something. You can look at this imagery in this card and, and, and do what you want to do with that. Um, wow. Wow, 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 wow. What is going on, Satch? This is wild thoughts, babe. I tell you what, though, I feel love. I feel intuitively that someone has left something that has extremely stressed them out. There definitely has been some juggling, absolutely, and there is some heartbreak, heartbreak hotel. I don't feel like the person that you are disconnecting from, Sagittarius, is uh, necessarily happy about this. I feel like you're choosing someone over somebody else. That's what I'm feeling here. Um, you're definitely walking away from something that you had an emotional connection to. And then on top of that, when you walk away... Look at that. You know what? The interesting thing that's really speaking to me in this energy tonight is this Four of Swords. You, 
you're done. Like, you're just like, and, and then the thing about it is, is that someone in your energy wants to talk about this. Someone in your energy thinks that you are reacting, that you are reacting um, too harshly about this, if that makes sense. I, I, I feel like someone is talking to you, Sagittarius, and saying, wait a minute. Just wait. Can we, you fill in the blanks, talk? you like, no, uh, no, no, no. You've gained a better perspective, honey. You are quietly preparing. Whomever has captured your attention... You've connected with them on a soul level. And for those of you who don't resonate with connecting with a person, a new person, this could be you connect, you already are with the new person and you're connecting with the past. Success. The connection that you have, whether it new or old, it, it defies an explanation. Sagittarius, you have been hot. Got me feeling hot. Now I'm really gone. I like my kisses down low. Mm, Kelly Rowland. You've been hot. What do I mean? I mean that I wanted to give extra special attention to your reading. Because I feel like with the How Does Bay Feel About You... You actually won in the most purchased extensions. So a lot of people are resonating. A lot of you guys who are either connecting with a Sagittarius or if you are Sag, that's probably the reason why because there's been a lot of... Everybody wanted to know what the extension said. Remember, in the How Does Bay Feel About You, we get how does Bay feel about you and then we get how you feel. This is in, in reverse. So this is how you feel about somebody. And then we're going to do a completely the exact same spread on the person that you're connecting with, the energy that is connecting with you. And you got a decision to make, but I don't really feel like you're in this. We're about to clarify. You're, you're done. You've made your decision. You know that the decision is going to cause some upset. If this is a marriage, it's over with. I hate to say that. There's been some type of some, some type of financial upset that I see. Guys, let me know if it resonates. Drop it like it's hot in the comments. I know you guys will. Let me know what's up with this because there's nowhere else to go from the ten of wands but the ace. So there is a newfound passion. And the stress, the stress is being left in that tower. It blew up. It blew up with that tower, honey. She's swimming and he diving. The stress is being left. And someone has completely mentally cut this out. The Sag is deciding to pour the energy into the union of two hearts. They're being guided by their angels as well as um, indicative of this judgment card. That this new union, this new passionate union that I feel... Although the Ten of Wands is here, they're one notch away from the Ace. Okay, Sages, and you're pouring your passion into this person. And I hate to see, I hate to, I hate to. These three right here are very telling. The judgment has came. Two people are involved with the lover's card, and then someone is going to get hurt. If this is a marriage, you guys are fiercely battling it out. Um, with who's going to get what, dividing up something that has some type of finances. That's a big lighthouse. You know, maybe it has something to do with money. That's my iPad. I don't know. It'd be lighting up, okay? So if you hear that, I apologize. <laughs> it's time to clarify. I apologize. If this resonates with you, please drop it like a hot sash. But I just see that you've gotten to the point where you're like, uh-uh. I'm done with this. There is eight cups of love. I've turned my back. If this would have been any other spread, I have been juggling some things financially with this two of pentacles. Absolutely. 
I no longer want to do that with the Four of Swords. Mentally, I'm done. I'm taking a complete break from this. Um, Buck Naked Susie is back. Mm, mm, mm. Clarify this Eight of Cups for me, Spirit. Clarify this Eight of Cups. Why is Eight of Cups here? King of Cups. Your feelings. The offer. Done. Kaput. Why is the tower here? The Ten of Cups. The end of love. Happy life. Look at that. If that does not clarify that tower, if that doesn't clarify that this is a relationship that is over, I don't know what does. Thank you, Spirit. You are working with me tonight. Mm. Clarify the stress. It's been stressful. Cross watches for Sagittarius. If this resonates with you, this is absolutely a very stressful thing. The Ten of Cups lets me know that there was a lot of love. I feel like this relationship went on for a long time. Um, but it's been stressful. What clarifies my Ten of Wands, my stress, my heavy load, my burden, my responsibility is the Four of Pentacles. There's been some type of financial loss associated with this um, breaking up. There has been a loss of emotion, a loss of love, a loss of a family life. Children are involved. Money is involved. No one is speaking. Two fours means repair. We have a four of swords in the main energy. We also have a four of pentacles in the clarifying energy. This is done. There's no talking. Um, there has been just a mental shutdown. No one is talking. This is pretty much over. Um, again, if it resonates, great. If it doesn't, let it escape. Cross watchers for Sagittarius. If this, is, if this resonates more with you and this is being done to you by Sagittarius, please, by all means, let me know that. Four of Swords is the Three of Pentacles, so there's been a complete breakdown. Um, again, Four of Swords, Four of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. The working together and trying to come to some type of reciprocity has completely shut down. There was a sense of let's work together, let's not let the kids X, Y, and Z. Let's not, you know, something with assets. Let's not argue about this. Um, you're trying. Some of you guys, I don't see justice, but you try to do this amicably amicably and it did not work for some of you guys um you try to keep this out of the courts maybe or you try to come up with something amongst the two of you guys and it's just not working um the shutdown may be now at this point we go to the courthouse um we we go and retain lawyers or something I don't see the Six of Pentacles. I don't see the um, the uh, Justice card. So um, I see that this is on the heels of being 100% over and taking it to the next steps to be over again. I told you that in your partner's clarifying energy, I see betrayal and I see double fives. So they know about, your partner knows about Buck, Buck Naked Susie. Okay, Sag. Um, and again, I'm feeling like they're telling you wait and you're, you've, you've had it. Um, and you're looking forward to the success with this new person that you have connected with. Okay. That is what I am saying. Um, I'm going to get into these Zodis in a second because I can tell you what. I feel like the union of two hearts. Somebody had this and I named the video that. Go through the videos and find out when I said the union of two hearts. Where's my mouth? Um, I told you to do it and then I'm doing it anyway. Look at me. Buck naked Susie was in Pisces energy. Um, the union of two hearts, I believe, was... Oh, God, I called it the union of two hearts. Somebody had the union of two hearts. I feel like it's Taurus because I don't see it. If you are a marvelous Madame aficionado, because clearly I'm not, then drop below where that union of two hearts is, please. Um, and that is who you are connecting with. Although I'm going to get into the Zodis in a second. Okie dokie, Sage. Let's hurry up here. Clarify this Two of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. Oh, my. Thank you. 
Woo! Three cards dropped. Very first one on the top was the devil, the king of pentacles, and the world. I'm not taking either one of them. That devil was upright. Mm -mm. I'm not going to do that to you. Sag, but I appreciate everybody connecting with you. And if you are a Sagittarius yourself, you definitely should have went first. If I have some time, I'll do something extra special for you, maybe on IGTV. Because you did get the most purchased extended. Clarify the Two of Pentacles. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? Why? Show me. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? The Two of Pentacles is here because of the Eight of Pentacles. So, there was a sense of putting in the work at some point. Maybe someone was focused on the financial aspect of this breakup too much. Um, and as a result, as a result of that started to juggle too much and it just wasn't working. There is no working um, it out. Um, clarifying energy, double tower. Something definitely blew up. Page of Wands and the Emperor. This definitely involves children. And then if we peek, there's the Five of Cups. So, as we wrap this up and go into your, clear, your, your extended... Something is over. We got the tower twice, okay? Extended. So extended. Clarifying in main, okay? Both times, okay? Page of Wands. This is a passionate message, um, but I'm feeling like at some point you decided that you were okay passionately wanting to leave I feel like or this represents a fire sign child really quickly we have Aries energy here you guys are connecting really quick I see water I see earth I see swords for air cups for water everybody's here you're connecting you can be connecting with every element Sag um that is what I'm feeling here um the the t I feel like the strongest could definitely be that Sagittarius Cancer thing that's been going back and forth. Um, the strongest love energy here is power is is power. The strongest love energy here is water, obviously. Um, and it it could be a situation where you're connecting with someone that has water, um, and then Sag has left for someone that has air. Wow. Again, it's going to be a successful union of two hearts. That might be what I call it. Like, share, subscribe to the Marvelous Tribe. Catch me in the extension if you care to watch. Let me know whether this resonates. This is heavy energy, guys. I want to know. Something is definitely over. It involves a lot of money. Four of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles. Pentacles is all over this thing. Somebody is pissed off about the amount of money. Somebody is battling about this money and having to hold on to it. We're going to go ahead and go um, crack off and pop off this extension and see how this person that you're connecting with is feeling about this being over. Okay? Bye, Sage.